Hey everybody, um, I know it's been a while since I've done one of these sit down and record videos, but I think something needs to happen. Um, this is, it's definitely a serious topic, and I, I wanted to, um, I wanted to address it. Now, the minor saving community, it's not right to a really high extent. These are an example, and not even to mention these, or let alone something like these. These are not as bad, but they're still against TOS as far as I'm concerned. But we're not going to even really mention that stuff like what I'm about to show actually goes on in shouts. This is unacceptable. Like, I've never, you know, it's always gotten under my skin whenever I see something, you know, just casually harassing the devs over an item, uh, breaking, or something like that, you know? It's kind of always gotten under my skin, but I've never thought much of it. But when you see, like, this happening to such a well-done game, like, back in 2017 and before, and you rarely saw bypasses and shouts and stuff. You, you rarely saw things like that, because people had more respect for the game. And I think when there's just bans being handed out left and right, um, like, when people got banned for the Midas Blaster thing, that was also another issue, because they had... They had no idea that for just using a bug, they were going to get banned. Now, obviously, yeah, it got carried away. I think it, to some extent, was reasonable. There's not much else you could do. You're you're not just going to revert people back, like, 10,000 lives. But on the other hand, there, there was some complication. Now, besides the fact that the entire community is... Well, not the entire community, but a handful of the community just decided whenever a dev gets online or especially goes offline they just start saying the most racist things and shouts now it's unacceptable and i'm not showing a lot of those for obvious reasons i don't want anything happening in my stream but to or not stream recording but to some extent it's just straight out wrong i don't think that the devs have done anything intentionally wrong towards the community. Now, on the other hand, there is another thing going around that I think needs to be addressed immediately. Now, right now there's a guy going around named Matt Nix, um, and he's kind of ruining what could be, I guess, the future of Miner Haven content um, for a lot of us, like, I, I think it'll be fun maybe doing like a charity stream or something, but because of uh, Matt Nix here, it's really not possible, and I've done as much debunking as I can, and I could almost 100% guarantee that it is Matt Nix, and I'm going to show some of my proof here. Now, this is the chat logs from my game, uh, my stream night, or my stream for a game night. Oh my god, I can't talk today. The one day I do a commentary video, this happened. Now, I, I thought it was straight up wrong um, that not only I was attacked, because if I get attacked, I, I'm used to something like that. I, I've gone to the point where I've gotten hate, I've gotten pretty much anything a YouTuber gets their uh, their spoon feed worth of, and I, I thought, okay, it was nothing more than that. But not only was it me, it was every one of Newbie's streams a Mr. Roblox stream, a Sky stream, and even Evan Bear. He's a Roblox star creator. We can't really let things like that slide. Now, the fact it could get us banned off of the platform, it's it's wrong. Now, I've talked um I've talked to people, there's not too much in-game we could do about it, but on YouTube I'm doing as much as I can to get them banned. Um and I'm doing my best. Now, they they do have intentions of getting us banned. Um, and they're constantly making our streams end. There's, there's nothing we could necessarily do about it without getting this person banned. But it could harm us. Like, I could wake up the next day banned or something. 
Um, we don't really know how things are gonna go down. All in all, I thought something had to be done about the minor saving community. Something's really not right. Um, because I can almost guarantee you back in the days of 2017 and 2018 and prior, um, stuff like this really wouldn't have been happening, if not, uh, very rarely, so. Um, if anything, though, I just wanted to put my two senses in, uh, help spread the word, honestly, about Matt Nix, because this is really unacceptable that he's only targeting us as far as we could tell. Um, us meaning the Miner's Haven community, um, assuming he's part of the community as well. So, I just wanted to let you guys know about all this. Um, I'm not too upset that I got view about it, I'm just upset of how common it is, and that now that I have proof it was him, that's who. So, I just want to let you guys know that, and uh, yeah, peace out. Also, for those of you interested in Time Machine, Evan Bear also said he might do a video on that, so guys, go check out his channel. He's pretty cool. He's, uh, he is the star creator I was talking about earlier, so he he did say he was interested. I don't know if I could promise anything, but, um, it was brought up, so yeah. Alright, see ya!